Hello everyone, welcome to the Bug Expert channel. In this video, we will talk about solutions for friends who encounter riot client not opening problem. This problem is usually accompanied by a damaged or corrupted installation of the application on the computer. Of course, it can happen not only because of this problem, but also because of many errors. For this, we will try to solve the problem by telling you a few suggestions. Before we show you solutions, we will briefly talk about the forum. You can forward various errors you encounter to the community on the forum portal we have opened. For this, if your problem continues or if you encounter a different problem, you can get a quick response by sharing it on the forum portal. We care about your questions and suggestions. The firewall might be blocking the Riot client application. To avoid this, we will need to allow a few valuable applications from the Windows Defender firewall. For this, first of all, Let's completely close the Riot applications running in the background. For this, let's type Windows Defender Firewall in the Start Search screen and open it. Click on Allow an app or feature through Windows Defender Firewall on the left side of the screen that opens. After this, click on Change Settings and allow another app. In the new window that opens, click the Browse option in Follow Me and confirm the firewall for Riot applications, respectively. After completing the process successfully, you can run the Riot client application as an administrator and check if the problem persists. Disable any antivirus program you are using or delete it completely from your computer. If you are using Windows Defender, disable it. Before doing this, let's close the Riot application from the processes with the help of a task manager. Let's write virus and threat protection on the start search screen and open it. Click on the Manage Settings option on the screen that opens and scroll down the menu and click on the Manage Controlled Folder Access option. After this process, let's disable the Controlled Folder Access option and come back. Let's turn off the real-time protection that comes up and go down again and click on the Add or Remove Exclusions option. Select the folder by clicking the Add and Exclusion option on the screen that opens, and select the folders where the Riot Client application is installed and save. After the save process is complete, you can run the game and check if the problem persists. We can eliminate the problem by running the Riot client application with administrator privilege. For this, let's run and check by assigning the administrator privilege to the determined applications by following the steps I have shown in the video. If your problem persists, the Riot client application may not work due to the VGC service not working properly. For this, we can eliminate the problem by repairing the VGC service. After the deletion is complete, let's run the Riot client application and click the update button in the Valorant application to perform the update. After the update process is complete, let's type services in the start search screen and open it. 
In the new window that opens, find the VGC service and double-click it. After this process, let's set the startup type automatically, start the service and save it by clicking the apply button. Check by restarting the computer after the save process is complete. If your problem persists, we can eliminate the problem by clearing the cache of the Riot client application. For this, first run the task manager and close the Riot application if the processes are open. In the start search screen, type the file location I showed in the video and press enter. Open the Riot games folder in the new window that opens and clean all the files in it. After the deletion process is complete, you can check if the problem persists by running the Riot client application. If none of these steps solve you, you can try to install on a different disk by deleting the Riot client files from the installed disk. Some users observe that they have achieved the solution of the problem by performing this operation. We can fix the problem by doing this. Yes, in this video we have provided information on how to fix the Riot client not opening issue. If you are encountering various errors, you can reach the community with your questions by accessing the forum portal we have opened. By supporting us, we can expand our community. Thank you.